my name is uh, Tariq Abu Hamid. I am originally from uh, East Jerusalem. I did all my studies in uh, Turkey in the field of uh, chemical engineering. I worked at the Weizmann Institute for uh, three years, uh, then for another uh, two years at the University of uh, Minnesota in the Solar Energy Laboratory. Uh, and now I'm working as the director of Center for Renewable Energy and Energy Conservation at the Arava Institute. We are teaching several, several courses in the field of renewable energy. One of them is the uh, introduction to renewable energy sciences. The goal of this course is to give the students an introductory information about the history, the utilization and the storage of the renewable energy sources such as uh, solar energy and solar thermal. Uh, the wind energy, geothermal, uh, fuel cells, and the, the energy storage. Here we test and evaluate the photovoltaic, uh, different photovoltaic technologies. We test them under the real conditions of the Arava Valley. Uh, we test the effect of uh, temperature, the radiation, and the performance of these, uh, of these panels. One of our projects is to find a way to cool the photovoltaic panels uh, using air without, without water and this is a joint project between the Arava Institute and the German Jordanian University in, uh, in Amman. This is a, a solar hydrogen lab. Here we are uh, producing hydrogen from water. The main goal of this project is to produce the hydrogen inside the car itself. If this works, it will be the alternative for the, for the oil. And because it's a closed cycle, and because it uses the solar energy, which is renewable, which is clean, that means that there will be no need for oil and there will be no emissions from this process. That's pretty exciting. It is. It is. It is. Put our fingers and see.